seen on WSAV. You know, many times there are special events that come up in our area and you are in the planning stages of either a wedding or a special event. And we decided to call on the special folks at Tybee Island to find out one of the best destinations around. And joining me right now, of course, is Vicki Nelson, who is the event planner and coordinator for the Tybee Light Station and Tybee Historical Society. Hi, Vicki. It's so great it's to nice see to you. you. Okay. I'm so glad to talk to you here and have you here on the southern scene. So let's talk about the Tybee light station and the Tybee Historical Society because this really is a picturesque I mean place it is it and is. so it's quite a place to have a special event or a wedding so let's talk about that I mean why is this so special for brides to be and special events well it's a very unique as you said very unique setting okay we do have air cottage we have the outside field area the inside courtyards we have the museum across the street we have something for everybody I mean, it's just a very, very unique setting. How many brides can actually say they're taking away a piece of history? So tell me some about some of the events that you guys have done, because, you know, you've talked about some of the cottages and, and you, we, you were pointing out the lighthouse and, and that kind yeah. of thing. So, and they actually, what, you were talking about the most popular areas as well. So maybe kind of walk me through some of the special events you guys have had. Our most popular area for our weddings would be the raised cottage, because that can facilitate anywhere from 20 to 150 people. That's a lot of people. It's a lot of people, but in order to facilitate that many, you do have to have the cottage, and then we set a fairy tale tent beside the cottage and connect the two. Oh, which would make it even larger for your, for your parties Absolutely. that are coming in. That way they can intertwine between the outside and the inside, so it gives them something a little different. And then our smaller weddings and our elopements are actually done at the top of the lighthouse. It's pretty now. amazing. Now, of course, a big event coming up that we're all familiar with, the Georgia Bridal Show. Yes. Loads of vendors are going to be there. Now, you guys are going to be there as well. We are. Why is that so important to you guys to participate in the Georgia Bridal Show? And what are some of the things that brides-to-be and families can expect from the Tybee Light Station, the Tybee Historical Society? Well, the Tybee Light Station, a lot of people really do not realize they can get married here. They're thinking, okay, it's a historic site, has a historic lighthouse. They think it's a venue just to come to visit. So by being in the bridal show, it gives us the opportunity to showcase the lighthouse as a wedding venue. So it is just, it's just a lot of good advertisement for us. We have a lot of wonderful brides that come in that book with us through that show. So we just enjoy showcasing the lighthouse. And listening to you, it sounds like it's very important to really customize to what your client is actually looking for. It is. How important is that to get to know those families and, and the bride and just give her what she wants? It's a very important because each, each bride is unique. Each bride has their own idea of what they want. So it's our job to work with them and to give them what they want to where that, that wedding day is just exactly what they pictured. So how soon in advance, uh, you know, do people need to be thinking about picking up that phone or going to your website and, and getting in contact with you guys if they think that this might be something that they're looking for? With what we have seen this year, a year to a year and a half. Wow, you're um, kidding. They're booking up very quickly. And, you know, we've already had brides that have called for 2015. Wow. So we're big in advance into 2015 as well. It's just a lot of planning that goes into, you know, into play. And, and for those brides that are getting down to the Georgia Bridal Show, now you guys have some incentives for if they come and see you guys that day. We do. If they actually book that day, we are offering a discount. Oh, wow. So okay. we're excited. We'd like to get some more brides. We'd <laughs> like to have every weekend full. So, yes, absolutely. If they come in and they book with us, we're absolutely going to give them a discount. Well, Vicki, I can tell you're passionate about this and you really enjoy what you do. Why is this so important to you to be involved with this? I, I absolutely love every one of my brides that come in. You know, I aim to give them what they want. I aim to work with the budget that they have. Um, I see joy in their face and I feel joy. So I do, I absolutely love what I do. Well, you can tell it. And I just want to thank you for letting us uh, bring thank our you. Southern Scene cameras okay. here thank and you. giving us the opportunity to see how wonderful and beautiful it is out here at the Tybee Light Station and the Tybee Historical Society. Thank you for coming. If you'd like more information on the Tybee Light Station and the Tybee Historical Society, all you have to do is go to the information you see right there on your screen. It is a 
fabulous destination. And of course, if you are looking for more information on the Georgia Bridal Show, well, you've got the information right there on your screen where that is concerned as well. And take the time to get to the Georgia Bridal Show. So many vendors will be there. And make sure you stop by the exhibit with the Tybee Light Station and Tybee Historical Society. They'll tell you everything you need to know about Tybee Island for that next special event. You can also get in contact with us here at the station. You can go to our Facebook page, The Southern Scene, or you can go to our website, WSAV.com. Just click on our Southern Scene page. We'll make sure we put you in contact with the Tybee Light Station and Tybee Historical Society.